checking to see if we can do a really quick uh, one minute hack for wearing backpacks and that's backpacks how it, as how it relates to having better posture um, I'm sure all of you guys have seen kids with their heavy 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 backpacks and they're walking up the hill to school and they're bent forward I think a lot of people have the idea that, that backpacks pull you back your body won't let you just fall back so what it'll do is it'll compensate by bringing your body forward and additionally in order to keep the weight of these um, straps uh, anchored into the shoulders it'll tend to roll the shoulders forward so it does actually while you might think it's pulling you back it's actually doing all the things that you don't want to happen it's it's um, causing the body to come forward from the hips or lower um, or the, the mid back um, it's causing the body to want to draw the shoulders forward and then of course with that reflexively the head is going to come forward which is going to help counterbalance the fact that you have weight back there. So one of the best hacks that I love to do myself if I'm traveling um, and of course your kids can do it, you can do it, is to put that backpack in the front. When you do this, this has some pretty cool side effects. So first of all, by putting the weight uh, in front of your center of gravity, your body's not going to want to drop forward. That would make it more unstable. So what does it do? It actually pulls itself up. And where does it pull itself up from? From the shoulders. Now, does it pull them down a little bit too? Yeah, that's not good, but it's better than the converse of dropping forward and down. At least you're coming back and down now. Uh, the other uh, benefit of this is in order to keep this backpack here, you have to square your shoulders up a little bit. That means you have to engage the muscles back here behind the shoulder blades and you don't engage these ones in the front, which most people are, are spending too much of their time doing the opposite. So, this is something I want you to. Um, you, your kids, uh, go ahead and give that a try. See how that works for you. Let me know down in the comments below and I'll be trying to give a lot more quick tips. So subscribe.